It's called the corpse flower because of its horrifically foul smell, but it's so rare that San Diegans are dying to see it. But if you want to check it out, you got to act fast. It's one of the largest flowers in the world, and it bloomed yesterday at the San Diego Botanic Garden in Encinitas. And the flower tends to open in the late afternoon of the first day. Ours opened up yesterday at 4 p.m., and then by 6, 7 o'clock, it was really pretty putrid. Ari Novi is the garden's CEO, so I asked him to describe pretty putrid. It really smells like a mix of rotting meat, old fish, dirty gym shocks, with a little bit of like garlic thrown in there, actually. Believe it or not, that smell has an important purpose, attract pollinators. There are apparently insects that are kind of like carrion beetles and things like that in Sumatra that are like, that sounds great. But guess who showed up this morning got quite a surprise, little to no smell at all. The plant is resting and will start getting stinkier as we get closer to sunset. For many, believe it or not, that was kind of a bummer. So you're disappointed it doesn't smell worse. Yes, I'm very disappointed that it doesn't smell worse. Everything is a part of the system, right? It's about how it looks, how it smells, how it feels, how it like sits within its environment and everything. And so it's a little sad to be deprived of one of our senses. The plant only blooms for two days, then kind of falls apart and goes dormant, which is a precarious period for it because if it's going to die, it usually happens then. If it survives, it'll start building up energy again, and it could flower again in three to five years. Its rarity always attracts a big crowd for the bloom. A lot of people ask, especially kids, they go, oh my God, does that plant like eat people? It, look, it looks like it could, but it doesn't. It's a totally vegetarian plant. Even the insects it catches, it releases them again so that they can go and pollinate. So it's a, it's a pacifist, but it looks kind of mean. The San Diego Botanic Garden will have extended hours tonight, specifically for corpse flower viewing and smelling. They'll stay open until 10 p.m. In Encinitas, Steve Price, CBS 8.